Hi, my name is Prem Asim Jain and in this Mongo lecture we are going to learn about renaming the collection and renaming the databases. So uh, I am on the console and if I I am on Mongo console if I do DB I am in the pcat collection. So I uh, let me see how many collections I have and if I want to rename any of the collection let's say this uh, Mm, uh, backup collection as something else so I just need to do db dot collection name which would be whatever and then you can rename it and this takes the another argument which would be the new name it just takes one argument so I can say products underscore or in camel case because JSON uh, works with camel case rather than underscore so this would uh, rename and if we say again show collections it won't show us the last name but the new name so it has been replaced so this is how we would uh, rename a collection but when coming uh, to um, do the renaming of a database uh, mongo does not provide uh, something straightforward in its api documentation so there is a workaround so workaround goes this way that uh, we might have to um, for renaming we need to copy the database and then uh, drop it so what I mean is so we have pcat database and I want to create a backup copy so we uh, we are targeting to do a um, renaming basically for this so we will try to first see db dot if there is something which so after db there is only uh, as per the syntax the collection has to follow so there is nothing uh, for rename as such if there are removes or whatever uh, which can happen basically so what we will do over there here is we will do db dot copy and copy so we have copy commands over here and this would take two arguments first would be the mm, uh, source database and second would be the destination so source database could be the name of this database which would be pcat and uh, the destination we can say as pcat new and then once we will do the enter so it gives the acknowledgement by saying ok otherwise it would throw an error so essentially what would happen that we have two databases with the same collection same everything inside them let's try to say show dbs and then we see pcat pcat new and pcat uh, back this was something else i did before so uh, our motive was to rename since rename was not out of uh, the box available so we copied it here now there is something which is called as drop command so we will go db dot drop database basically so we have to use pcat and then db dot drop database so what would uh, uh, this do that this will help us to get rid of the pcat database so in effect if we will uh, show dbs so this is same as pcat has been renamed to pcat new so this is how uh, this works and same um, workaround is there to take backups for the collections so we'll see how to take database collections in our next lecture thanks for watching